Does God hear and answer my prayers? Will there be McDonald's in heaven? heaven? Will I be able what to about people who have never heard about Jesus? Is there only one way to God? Or is it called oh, I, I think I need to pester a pastor. Hey everybody, welcome to Pester a Pastor. I am Claire and I have got my friend Jeff with me today who happens to be a pastor at The Crossing Church. So Jeff is a pastor, but you're also a dad. Yes. Which I think makes you perfectly prepared to answer tough questions that kids have posed about God and faith. Here is your next question. Let's go. Do miracles happen today? So the short answer to the question is, I think miracles do happen in the world today. And one of the reasons that we can know that is the way that the Bible describes who God is and how he interacts with us. So God is far above all things, beyond us. He's the creator of all things, right? He's the infinite creator God, but he's also God with us. And so God is not just this distant observer of our world and our lives. He is intimately aware of and involved with our world and our lives. And so we see this throughout the story of the Bible uh, in many different ways, Old and New Testament. But we also see it in our world today, the ways that God works through his people in ways that surprise us, where God reveals himself and his kingdom at work in ways that don't seem to match the ways that we would expect the world to work. What do you mean by that? So what I mean is like, I think that there are ways that God can reveal himself in surprising ways, whether that's in ways of revealing who he is to people. Okay. So sometimes people have these experiences where they feel like there was a miraculous event where they had a clarifying moment of who God was and it felt like something that was beyond what they would expect. It was surprising. Okay. But also there are these areas where you see God restoring his creation in really surprising ways, whether that's through people who have sicknesses or illnesses or people who um, need restoration in relationships and they feel like when they see God working, it's ways that can't be explained by yeah. science or can't quite be exp- explained by a doctor, or ways we would normally explain how our world works. Yeah. And so there seems to be this way in which God loves to work in ways that go beyond how we would expect and surprises us in the ways yeah. that he reveals himself. What would you say to give somebody hope or encouragement mm-hmm. when they want God to act in a miraculous way and it doesn't feel like that's happening. Yes, I think that's a really good question. I think it's worth saying that even though miracles do happen in the world today, that doesn't mean that we should expect or demand that they happen in the way that we want them to happen or uh, when we want them to happen. Okay. So there's this posture that even Jesus had in his pr- uh, prayer in the Garden of Gethsemane. Yeah, okay. Not your will, but my, w- not my will, but your yeah, will yeah. be done, right? And so I think that one of the things that I'd say to people is the biggest miracle that we could possibly imagine is the resurrection of Jesus. Uh, life from death. And that is the miracle that we see in the story of the Bible, but also it's a miracle that we are looking forward to all of us yeah. in the new heaven and new earth with resurrected bodies. And so um, I do think it's okay to pray for and ask for God to intervene in ways that would go beyond what we would expect yeah. in our world today. But we also have this firm hope that one day the greatest miracle is still yet to come. That's awesome. Okay, thank you. That's really, really helpful and yeah. encouraging. Yeah. If you could sum that up. Yeah. That question in one sentence, do miracles still happen today? I think yes, miracles can still happen today. That doesn't mean we have to expect them all the time on our own timeline the way we would want them to happen, but God can do whatever he wants. He's the creator and sustainer of all things. So yes, miracles can happen today. He's all powerful. He's God. Yes. Hey guys, tune in next week. We'll have another pastor to pester. Bye.